What's going on guys, Casual Savage here, and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to distort your audio in Audacity. Just before I get into this video, if you find this video helpful, be sure to hit the like button, be sure to hit the subscribe button, and also be sure to go ahead and follow my social media, I'm on Twitter, Instagram, and of course, Snapchat. Now the distortion effect will work on music and of course on talking as well, and it's very very simple to do. So what I'm going to do is just play through what I currently have. I bet the day you stop messaging me, you went to Vegas. Last time you went to fuck a stripper, this time did you fuck a waitress? It's funny how you would tell someone you love that you done that. I okay, so you can tell the vocals are normal, uh, no distortion to it just yet. Now, of course, you can add it to the entire thing by just left clicking here and highlighting. However, if you want to add it to certain parts, then left click, highlight that area that you can see, and then only this area will be affected. First of all, I'm going to be showing you how to add it to the entire track, so I'm just going to left click here. We're going to come up to effect and we're going to select distortion. Now for the distortion type, I do reckon hard overdrive. For the distortion amount, I recommend anywhere between 5 to 10. Uh, for this one, I'm going to go with the 7. And then for the output level volume, again, it's all personal preference and it depends on your audio. However, I do recommend anywhere between 50 to 65. And this I'm going to change to 55. Now, once you're happy with everything, just select apply. As you can see, it's going to be applying and select close. So you can see this has now changed the audio waveform. However, the audio will also be um, distorted. So I'll play it through from that same part again. I bet the day you stop messaging me, you went to Vegas. Last time you went to fuck a stripper, this time did you fuck a waitress? It's funny how you would tell someone you love it. So you can see that's how that part sounds. Now with this uh, song, it actually has a part where talking happens, so before the actual rapping starts. So that would be a good place to add a distortion, of course, instead of over the rapping. So I've zoomed in here, and I'm going to find the parts where the talking starts and then where the talking stops. Okay, so up to here, from to the beginning, there is all talking. So like I said, talking would be a good place to add distortion if it's for music, so I'll add distortion here. I'll keep my settings as they are and I'm going to select apply and close. Now of course the transition between both won't be as smooth just yet but let's just play it through. August 12th, does it mean anything to you? Do you even remember? Probably not. Happy anniversary to you too. Nothing to me anymore. Just a heartless bitch. Today but among the fourth year being... So you can see that part was then distorted and it went quite normal. Um, the transition actually wasn't very, it wasn't bad. Um, so that's a good thing. You wouldn't have to do much with that. And that is it. So you want to add it on certain parts. You left click highlight. If you want to add it on everything, you left click here in this box and everything gets highlighted. 